a little bit of a muddled story, but a story that I think we'll all enjoy. Kevin Owens, Sami Zayn, <laughs> The Miz, and Cesaro. The MVP of Payback. Yes. <laughs> KO has not has never let go of the idea that that's his <laughs> Intercontinental Championship. And well, he, as he should have. He's no. still... His contract. Like, I'm glad he brought <laughs> up, because any other superstar or in WWE the for the last five years... If they don't get their rematch, they just don't get right, their it rematch. Just, it just gets let go. It's just let go. They don't care about it. He cares about it. He talks about it. Demands Him and Paul it. Heyman are the only people that have done that. Yeah. Him and Paul Heyman. <laughs> so you got someone that's not a wrestler, and you got someone that's probably one of the best wrestlers right. on the show right now. They're the only ones smart enough to, to go and say it. I'll tell you what. When he when he won the match at Payback, I immediately said, I was like, that's, that's a future heavyweight champion right there. You know, that's, that's where he's going. You know, AJ Styles may have, like, a clean loss later on, and then we'll see tomorrow KO in, in Roman's face. And then two minutes later, he's talking about the IC title. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> okay. And I'm happy they did that because he makes a lot more sense. No no offense to Zack Ryder. I, I thought it was, you know, good moment for him at Mania. But he got his rematch. He, he, <laughs> make, he, yeah, makes, he, he makes more sense with the belt than Zack Ryder. He makes more sense with the belt than The Miz. I mean, Cesaro would be a good Intercontinental Champion, but... You know, Kevin, Kevin Owens up. makes more sense than anyone else. That's a fact. Well, this whole story got kicked off with the first ever one-on-one Sami Zayn-Kevin Owens match on a WWE pay-per-view. Did it live up to what I'm sure everybody expected it to be? Oh, yeah, the match, no doubt, was great. The match was awesome. It, it was awesome, no doubt. One of the best matches of the night. But a key thing that played to this match is the commentary and the continuity, even through the Intercontinental t- title stuff. The continuity was great. The commentary, they put over that there's actually, like, real true jealousy right. between these two guys. And JBL, even JBL was saying, um, remember, this is about new stars in, in, in the future. JBL was saying, Kevin Owens is a future world champion. Byron also said, oh, Sami Zayn could be a future world champion, too. That ma- The match was awesome. I, I didn't uh, see. At first, I had a problem with Owens. Like, you know, I, I thought Sami Zayn needed to win because... Yeah. He's been losing more lately, and it worked. I was thinking it, the same thing. It wouldn't hurt Kevin Owens because Kevin Owens is already a made guy, and he's such a good heel that you could just wipe off the loss. So when Kevin Owens won, I was like, okay, Kevin Owens won. But then he cut that promo, talking about going back at this icy title, and then he just like kind of kicked Sami Zayn out the ring. I was like, where's Sami Zayn? Like, like why is he coming? Why is he coming out now? Yeah, I was expecting him to come back. Yeah, right away. Aw- and save Byron from yeah, Owens. And yeah, then it didn't happen. Yeah, it didn't happen. I was like, all right. But let's talk about Kevin Owens and Byron. Interview me! Interview me! <laughs> Get a microphone! This is my, this is my good side. This is my good yeah. side. <laughs> but so at the good. same time, he came back, not at the time we would expect, but at the same time, Sami Zayn came back at the perfect, the perfect time. time. He came at the perfect time, but. That's what I'm saying, but that, that's why this paper. That's why so many things I have to say about this pay per view goes back and forth because of what happened later and on Raw. Well, here I'll say he came back at the perfect time because that was different. Every week, I'm not going to say we complain every week, but every week we mention on how they don't do something new. Not to say this has never been done, but this is not something that's watered down, and you don't see someone, you know, guest comment like you know, someone. Is in a match, wins a match. On the fly, and then, goes out and yeah, commentates. Yeah, hey, I just, I just won a match. But, you know, I'm going to go do commentary. And because that belt's mine. That belt's <laughs> mine. And then someone that just lost to you just comes up and starts kicking your ass. Yeah. You don't see that. I love that, one, because Kevin Owens was trying to make the point of, now that I put Sami Zayn behind me, I can refocus on what yeah, I'm supposed con- to be Continuity. On. And Sami Zayn comes back to show you in the end... You know, you're it's you're not even over. close to being done with me yet. And this sets up what I assume is, I don't think they announced it or anything no. yet, but I assume it's going to be a fatal four-way for the Intercontinental yeah. Championship, which I think is going to be great. Mm-hmm. Are you just assuming that because I sent that in a group text? No. I think I did assume that, but I think you reinforced the point to me. Okay. <laughs> just make it sure. If, yeah, if I can be clear. I'll, I'll, I'll give you, a, I'll give you a, 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 a credit for that. How about Owens wearing JBL's hat? Awesome. That was great. <laughs> that, was awesome. that was great. I, I love how he moved Byron's chair yeah. <laughs> and put the, the steel chair in and his speak. Oh my god! No, he's great. And then he, then he was like, "JBL and Byron, I, you, I'm way better than you in commentary. JBL not as good as you though." Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> right. He well, he hates Cole, hates Saxton. He is phenomenal at every everything he tries to do on TV is great. We had the actual Intercontinental match between the Miz and Cesaro. I thought Maurice again. 
played a factor she looked in great. the right oh, way. Yeah, she did look great. Yeah. I won't say she didn't, but the role she plays for the Miz is perfect for his character. Well, get it right. Looking good. Get yeah. it, get it right. <laughs> yes. In, in the words of Booker T, I think that it was good to have Cesaro look like he had the match won because he's supposed to be the stronger competitor. You're supposed to be making him look better. But I think it's great for everyone involved, and now these all four of these guys are going to be in some type of program over this belt, making it look important. Yeah. Like we said, Owens held up the belt, said it's mine. Last night on Raw, ultimately, Sami Zayn did the same thing. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah, I kind of yeah, like holding and then, this And then the, the go-home, didn't Cesaro do it? Uh, yes. Yeah, yeah Cesaro did, yeah. did do it um, two Mondays ago. Yeah, and the, cr- and the crowd ate Sami Zayn holding it up, too. Yeah. So we had... Kevin Owens against Cesaro as the first match on the show. Love the intensity that Cesaro started off that match with. Yeah. Like, he just wanted to kill Kevin. He, he went right to the uppercuts in the corners, mm-hmm. right out of the gate of that match. Uh, obviously, The Miz, who can't stand to be upstage, goes in and gets Kevin Owens disqualified. They end up beating down Cesaro. Zayn comes out to make the save. We get the good spot of him holding up the title. I just think that it's the Intercontinental title. I feel like it was lost in the shuffle a little bit since WrestleMania, and now it's since right it there. wasn't on Kevin right. Owens' shoulder. Once it left Kevin Owens, it was lost in the shuffle. Yeah, they don't need now two that mid-card he's talking about it again. Lost in the shuffle. Yeah. So this one now, all these guys have shown you how much they want it, how much it means to them. We've had. People say the different champions of the Miz put it over, saying the different yeah. champions that have held it. So it's I think the Intercontinental title is in great hands right now, and I can't wait to see the stories they tell for the next few weeks leading up to Extreme Rules. Do you think it'll just be a straight up fatal four way? Do you think it'll be anything crazier than that? I hope for a fatal four way elimination match. Because I feel like every time I've seen a fatal four way in the last five years, it's always one pinfall yeah. to the draw. Yeah, you don't see those real, real often. But I'm just—I I'm gl- feel like when I was growing up, that's what. If there was a fatal four way, it was an elimination match. Didn't matter if it was a tag match. Didn't matter if it was singles. If it was a fatal four way, it was an elimination. I'm just glad Sami Zayn. He he repeated what Kevin Owens did. Clean house was the last man standing in the ring. It was shades of what Kevin Owens did at Payback, and Sami Zayn needed that because he did lose clean. Yeah, they, they built him right back. Yeah, up. he needs that title. He lost clean. Sami Zayn is a Sami Zayn's over as a character, but. Right now, to get to get his popularity up, but the casual fan, he needs that title. We all want in mind seeing Sami Zayn as the IC champion, but even when it, when he held the title up, the crowd was chanting, "Yes, put him over." Right, I agree with that. And how great is the bullfrog splash, by the way? <laughs> Kevin Owens. He does an unbelievable frog Kevin splash so for a guy that size. The, I mean, from the apron to the floor, even. I think everyone on his moves is kind of Kevin phenomenal. Owens. I, don't, I don't know how, how people don't like Kevin Owens. Me neither. I don't know how either. I just don't know. His best move is when he does that, uh, that like moonsault where he does like a the, the, oh, the, the twirl. Yeah, yeah, but, but he never hits it. <laughs> don't matter. It's still good. It. It's still awesome to watch him <laughs> do it and miss. But he, I just wish he would hit it one day. He said, "Oh, it's like the move Rollins does. He never hit that Phoenix Splash. Yeah, he, very rarely. Very rare. I think he had to do. What did hit it one time? But it's really rare. 